Hello people and welcome back to another YouTube video. Now today is Doria's day. Christmas day in the evening between 10 o'clock and half past 10 in the, in the evening. I'm doing my preview for Lewin Town v Fulham for uh, Boxing Day on Thursday the 26th of December 2019. Now this is the second from last game before the New Year's hit. So we've got bo uh, this Boxing Day fixture at 3 o'clock against Fulham and then we've got Bristol, <coughs> Bristol City away on the 29th which is a Sunday which I'm not going to I made my decision now and then first game of see uh first game in the New Year's is Millwall away which I am going to and then Bournemouth on the fourth but going into this game today well tomorrow or whenever you watch this this video is recorded on Christmas Day like I said <clears throat> going into this game we're playing Fulham who are currently fourth in the league Yes, they're fourth. They're fighting for that place to go to the back to the Premier League. Now, the bottom four, of course, consists of Luton in 21st with <coughs> 20 points. Then we've got Barnsley, who are uh, have 19 points in 22nd. Then we have Wigan, who are 23rd who have got 19 points as well and then of course we've got Stoke who are also dead last but they're on 18 points now this this game here I know it's very tough for Luton but if any of them including Barnsley, Wigan or Stoke win their game and uh, we muck up and then it looks like we could be at the bottom of the table. That's Lewin Town, by the way. Could be at the bottom. Could be at the bottom. So I say Barnsley beat whoever they're facing. I'm not sure how they're facing. But if they win their game, they go ahead of us. If Wigan win their game, they go ahead of us. If Stoke win their game, they go ahead of us. So this, I know it's going to be very, very difficult. But this has to be a much match winning game. We have to win every game. Of course, every game is a must win game. But being in the championship is a different ball game. As I've said so many times during every video that I've done, different ball game, different league, so much harder. Big prem, former Premier League teams going down to the championship, playing them home and away. But here, this one on Boxing Day is must win but very very difficult as i already know and as luton fans already know it could be a pain in the bum but i'm not giving my hope i'm not giving my hopes out on luton sluger was in goal against <coughs> who was it who did we play i can't really remember Oh, that's it, Swansea City. We played Swansea City and he had a decent game. But we just keep seeing the sloppy goal at home. IU just shone it into the goal. So if we can cut out those crappy goals we concede in defence, then we can have a chance. But until we do that, we ain't got a chance. But now, this is where I'm getting into it. If we go bottom of the league... What's the chances of us going back up? I reckon we could, I, this this season. I've already said this season is all about survival and staying in the league. Then the next season, if we're still in the lead, hopefully Watford will be in the season. <laughs> Go to freaking Shitteridge Road, as I like to call it. But it's really it's called Fickeridge Road, but I call it Shitteridge Road because it's Watford Stadium, and I hate Watford till the day I die. That club right there is who I who I support. And it's staying that way. It is staying that way. But yeah, as I said, <laughs> this could be hell, hell to break loose. Fulham, now we played them away at their ground at Craven Cottage. We lost 3 2. Mitch Fitz scored a hat trick. I'm having a feeling he's going to score again. If we're not clear on the defensive side, 
he's going to score. And any well, to be honest, the last game we played against him, he scored all the goals. He scored a hat trick. He could have had four or five. Easy, easy at Craven Cottage. But no, we were lucky. We were lucky. But we still went out on a loss. But we have to see what happens. Tomorrow's a big game. Um, I'll probably stick with the same squad and formation, etc., etc. I'm not going to go for it. But if we get a scrappy 1 0 win or, or something from Fulham, that would be great. But as I said, this this is my preview. This is all I've got to say now. And this is going to be the end of it as well. So please like, subscribe, and I can hopefully do my review when I get back from the game, if I have the time. But as of now, thank you again for watching. Please like, subscribe, and peace out.